directly behind us. Now as we uh, make our way from the dock, we're going to be headed upriver for the trip today. You know how easily someone could jump over this? Oh, yeah. Why would you? I'm not saying I would, I'm saying people easily could. Why? You could easily jump off the Empire State Building, why would you? Actually, it's trying to make that harder if I say no, they're going to giant head. You can, if you're determined. Wait, the giant head? Yeah. yeah. So, if I stay going and go up the sides, and so you can't, you have to almost climb it to get up to. Yeah. I'm a boat captain, I'm a boat captain. This is the San Francisco Bridge. That's a cute old town right there. Well, the island there off to the left is known as a Memeluse Island. Memeluse is Chinook jargon for dead or land of the dead. It's where the Chinook Indians would bury their dead with all their worthy possessions or thought to be needed for afterlife. There's many more of these islands up along the river. The largest Memeluse Island is a state park up by the Dalles. I'm watching people eat. <laughs> My God, a soul. I don't know what I'm doing. I like the See, I could go upstairs with 100,000 people. My hands are so shaky. That's, that's the boat, that's so not me. That's Oregon, that's Washington. Yep, kind of like Ohio. Ohio okay, one side. Yeah. That's most of it is like that. Yep. Off to the left there, the large green glass building you see is the Columbia Gorge Interpretive Center. That's yeah, a full scale way. working fish wheel. A Locomotive. Just stand away, Mom. More exhibits in there as well. Just stand away. That's great. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> now, the mid 1800s, when the steamboats showed up here, they brought their own means of taking the salmon out of the river. They're known as fish wheels, they're just on the Columbia in 1879. They were powered by the river's current rotating scoops, much like Ferris wheels that scoop the salmon out of the river as they came along the shoreline. They could harvest as much as 68,000 pounds of salmon a day. The fish wheels were primarily, primarily operated here on the Cascade Rapids and the Dalles area. Now since I'm an avid fisherman and the fish wheels were outlawed in the early 1900s, I advised my own plan. I went up to the Stevens and Hardware, purchased myself a large wash tub. I took my large wash tub, found me a nice sandy beach, filled my wash tub with river water. Then I went down to the Eagle Creek Fish Hatchery, got some fertilized salmon eggs, went back to my sandy beach, dumped my fertilized salmon eggs into my wash tub. I raised them to fingerling size and let them go, since salmon always return their place to birth. About five years later, I took that very same wash tub to that very same sandy beach. I set my wash tub out by the water. And you know those salmon swam Boy. right up the river and Boy. jumped right into that wash tub. I would hope every day with the fish You look so excited. So do you. I'm filming. That's why I'm not filming him. Why not filming? I guess I started singing. Oh. oh.
Did you see me uh, video stalk her? What? Did you see me video stalk that woman? No. Oh, look, how's this? I think I filmed already. I'm people I got her soul. But we should go upstairs soon. But I need you to come with me. Half my face is going to be hurt. I need you. I'm going to get a nice sunny spot to get the vitamin D. Who are you on the phone with? I'm trying to call Uncle Billy, but he never answers his cell phone. Uncle Billy, you suck. Send this to Uncle Billy. Now he's already going to beat you up once a lot. I'll fight him. He's grounded. I'll, Uncle Billy, you watch this. I'll fight you. That's a fact. He's a big sissy. He's all on Phil, too. He was seven to school. <laughs> He's just like, oh, making fun of me. Don't fight all of Where's my hair? <laughs> you have to send this to me now. I do. Yeah, absolutely. I was enjoying it up until now. He's not completely bald, he has some on his face. Don't hit that thing in the middle. That's, that's not in the middle. I thought it was a person. There's a kayak over there. Jesus just chilling. No, like, there's a kayak over there. I was like, what the hell? I'm a real tall guy. Dude, we should go upstairs soon. It's a tall bun. You're my wingman. Oh, you're not my wingman. That sounds weird. That looks like Oliver's guy. You're my... Gulliver. Hey. Or Gilligan. That was all the paddle wheelers here running up and down the river. The thing crashed upon a point of land. It was usually named after the vessel that crashed there. I'm uh, looking up ahead here. I got it right, so too. Yeah, platform with a red triangle on it. This is gold dust. There's a big rock under okay, there. Okay, where gold where? dust crashed upon. That's gold dust. You know. There's Justin also uh, Umatilla rocks down there above Bonneville. There's also Fashion Ring you down mean by Baltimore Falls. All named after stir wheelers that crashed upon a point of land along here. But let's go upstairs. I'm gonna follow All the red Come markers on. you see are ace to navigation. There's three R's. Yeah, red, right, return. Everything red is going to be on your right hand side when you're returning from sea. But we're going to cruise by this. There's an osprey nest in there. Now, Osprey mate for life. They came, come back to the same nest every year. They also migrate as far south as Argentina. And there should be a uh, like. mama Osprey in there. I think there's some babies oh. in there. Oh, <laughs> never mind. I didn't like. I don't like covering the camera. Over this. I don't like you holding the camera over that. No, I know, Dad would be so pissed. Sorry for the language. I would be pissed. Instead of curse. We also have a few pairs of bald eagles in this area. The Osprey here, you seem to not see the bald eagles as much. They're not going to come out bigger than you as they do in the Pacific Ocean. Yeah, they're going to come out bigger than you as they do in the Pacific Ocean. They're going to come out bigger than you as they do in the Pacific Ocean. They're going to come out bigger than you as they do in the Pacific Ocean. They're going to come out bigger than you as they do in the Pacific Ocean. They're going to come out bigger than you as they do in the Pacific Ocean. If they're any good, they can get into that, and we can pull them all the way up the river and back down. So they'll be behind us there in the, in the swell. This is where the noise happens. Dude's just chilling. What's up? What's up? Hey, at least, at least. Oh, look, this guy doesn't even want clothes. We're being attacked. They're trying to... Well, at least, at least he has clothes on. There. Oh. Oh. 
Up, 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 up. We're going back the other way. That place had sunshine. I'm a walk captain. I'm a walk captain. Let's go. Welcome to the I mean, how we. The town here off to the left is Stevenson, Washington, the large base building you see up there, the courthouse, the county Stevenson. I don't know what she's talking about. Sorry, Ray folks. Was in 1864. Yeah, that left. I can't go over there. there. Huh? That's the uh, bridge of the gods. The, I'm zooming down the bridge of the gods, right? That bridge? Yeah. That's the bridge of the gods. They have a conversation, but all right. Oh my God, shut up. This is two hours. Now the Spray County Courthouse here was completely... I'm going to record all two hours. Uh, so if you want to get I'm, well, I'm going to kill all the memories. Hey, you have a judge come out. I want you right two off hours of cruise. It's the longest video. Longest than that black night. Remember the night? Oh, yeah. yeah. It's only 10... Back in the day. It's only 1022. Oh, my God. That means we have like five hours left. Five hours left. See if Biller's recording this to all the view you'd have. You enjoying that? Mountain? What are you, what are you Paris Hilton? Show me your face. Billy, are you enjoying the cruise? Talk to me. It's better than just driving. Hey, how'd you do in your tournament? Oh. You could have a real conversation with me right now. Good. Sorry, old lady, I filmed you. All I can see is my reflection. Oh, dude, I can look. I can do that thing. Look. Really. It does flip. See, Billy? Now you can see what I'm recording. You. Oh, that's creepy. Dude, come up here and chill with me. How many benches there are for you? No, man, I don't like that. Sit down on the bench, child. No. Now, this area was first explored by Lewis and Clark, became the fur traders, then the missionaries. After the missionaries came the legendary Oregon Trail pioneers. When they reached the Dalles, there was no river transportation except for canoes, rude rafts, and the Hudson Bay's bateaus, which were a large canoe that could hold three to four tons of freight with an eight to ten crew. 
Although there have been several nice speedboats working on the Willamette, the lower end of the Columbia since 1800. Oh, I, mean, I lost one. It wasn't until 1851 that there's a steamboat that operated above the area known today as Cascade Locks. The I name got all of your souls. that year began moving settlers down river from the Dow. This is the view you'd have with just Billy because he's boring. Huh? Let me tell you. Yeah. Just complaining all the time. I filmed the sun. <laughs> Blind our viewers. Our viewers. Like mom and dad. And Billy. No. Billy's not listening. Uh, just saying to him he's gonna be watching this. His tears have dried up by now. Are you that desperate to get off this boat? Talk about it either. I'm trying to pick you up. What are you trying? I'm trying to get that plane, but I can't because of the glare. My viewingness. There's still stuff to film. Where are you going? Oh. Bro. No, there's stuff over here. The Columbia River and its tributaries are made to rest of transportation. I was just dropped this. On the Oregon good. side, we have Interstate 84 and Union Pacific Main East West Rail Line, which runs about 40 trains a day. On the Washington side, we have Highway 14 and Burlington Northern Santa Fe Main East West Rail Line, which also runs about 40 trains a day. And we have the barge traffic that plies these waters. Water transportation of cargo is the cheapest form of shipping. The barge industry moves 12% of the nation's freight and 2% of fuel. That's mainly petroleum products going upriver and grain products going downriver. Oh, hey, there's... I'm filming that car. I'm trying to film that car. car? On the street. Where? It's gone. There's a lot of cars on the street. Over there. Over there. Oh, there's a car. Where? No, it's gone. You saw it, right? I'm not talking to you. 
Look at that. Look at this. Look at that. Look at this and that with Rusty. How's that for a reference? I don't know if you can tell, but we have plenty of trees. We have ADD. Cargo. I got that camera. Yep. But you're saying you smelled it. Garage boat. Boat garage, I mean. <laughs> it's a boat and it's a garage. I think it's just a ferry. Very delicious.
that's a uh, boat tunnel. Right? <laughs> it's a boat tunnel. Where <laughs> your boat? I can't stop. <laughs> the boat keeps shaking, but yeah, I got it. My arm hurts. No. <laughs> be a bit hard. We get the joke now. Because we are on a boat. And it is not on a boat. And I would have to swim to go get it. And I cannot swim with a camera in my hand. You're a blast, bro. You hear that? I'm a blast. I'm touching Billy. Like, right in the bone. Which is why he's smell smiling. And smelling. Smiling before. God. <laughs> now Barry Weather Lewis brought his pet dog with him. A big Newfoundland brought made the whole journey with him. At one time the natives came down, grabbed his dog, and took off. They sent someone out to retrieve the dog. They didn't find him and didn't get him back. They had a lot of dogfeed on their core discovery. They had more than 30 men to feed. They'd also pull into a camp and barter for dogs. Kind of idea that dog was a bit uncomfortable at times. What are you doing? I don't know. Fun. You look like a douchebag. That's a good dog. With the trick in your hand, just like, mmm. Well, I mean, it's good. Are you listening to this? This is the dumbest background noise. Congratulations. Yes, we do. That is a necessary thing. Yeah, but just put your head in the way. That's cool. I'm not filming a train. I'm filming your head. That's what I want. That was my goal. Thank you. I'm not kidding. Good. I want it like this. They're worried you pee off the edge. No one does that. You're more like this too. It's on your face. Get away from me. Stop. I don't want it. Stop. What's happening? Oh, stop. Not, I've seen longer. Speaking of cinnamon,
be a George. Gorge. He's the one who built this boat, Columbia George. That's some packs right there, you're welcome. I'm a boat captain, I'm a boat captain. Saying, but it's offensive. That's all I know. How is it offensive? No, you've heard of that, like, like the Jewish potato thing. The golem? <laughs> Just ignores me. I'm like, I'm gonna clean the lens. Sorry. For the, just enjoy the bench. It's a nice bench. Made in 1920 in Georgia. Stays in the bottom. Did you see that old guy die on the bench? No. He sat on the bench, lay down, then got up. He looked. What? Look it up ahead. The it's large old boxer. Mountain you see is Wind Mountain. Uh, then across the river there on the Oregon 271, side, you can see another oh, adult thing. Mountain. Mountain. 271 mountain. adult life. These are a twin sister extinct volcanoes are the exact same volume and height as they're still joined together under the Columbia River. Now at the base of Wind Mountain, we're uh, one of Lewis and Clark's campsites. If you're what? They stayed at. Babies are dead. Oh, uh, they're here. They saw a large bird that Babies are dead. By. They took a few pot shots at them. They could never get one down. They finally got one down. They got to the coast and it came back to be the first illustration of the California condor. California condor. I'm just filming those Asians. I'm not even being subtle anymore. Oh, I moved the bench. Can you move your head? I'm trying to film the smoke. Yep, put your hand away. That's what I wanted. Okay, I'm, not, I'm not even playing with you. <laughs> Step in there. I find that unsafe to say there's an axe right there. They can just open the bolt house and just kill them. You just take the axe and kill the cabin. You can just do that. You physically could do that. I could do that right now. Why are you talking about murdering the captain? Because it's a possibility that you could do that. I'm not talking. Something, Billy's giant head gets in the way. It's, a, it's awesome. What? Oh, okay. Did you film it? I didn't see it. Huh? Don't talk to me. Oh, I'm filming up there in my bed. I'm not even looking at what I'm filming. 
There's a stick. Not there. I mean down. Until it dies. Yeah, look. Stuffing races. through this area, they talked of many longhouse. Talked about many racist. longhouse huh? built up yeah. along here. They're made of cedar planks, some two to four feet. We're stuffing an ice cream shop. They're yeah. large, about oh, yeah. five to forty feet. Because I'm being such a downer. Well, by an extended family, by separated partition. You got me. As a fire pit was built down the middle, and a sleeping okay. platform were built along no. the walls. Kiss off, jeez. Some champagne. Hi. No, it's fine. Yeah. I'm gonna get her digits. <laughs> What's happening? Give me back my soul. Is she still there? Nope, good. <laughs> Are you making fun of me? Yes. Because you're old and feeble. Lincoln, <laughs> Lincoln called me fat. <laughs> but he still plowed that. That's gross, miss. That's gross. What, is she like 200 years old? <laughs> we need to put her in a museum. That's more interesting than my video trip. Video trip? I'm gonna stop talking. Actually, she might be 200 years old. 400. Yeah, Lincoln was on the 1800s. No. No, was she? I'd be like 300 years old. He was around in the 1800s. Yeah. But, uh, she could have been, he could, she could have been like a teenager. When he allowed that. I'm done with this. He, she could have. I don't think there's any rules against that back then. My brother just called Lincoln a pedophile. Well, you never know. That can't be unsaid. Why is he your favorite president? I'm not, I'm not getting this with you. Stop filming nothing, sorry. Sorry. Who are you? Just making weird noises into the camera. I want my son back. I got got by little Jimmy. Be gone. Billy, do you know the Love Boat theme song? Sing the Love Boat theme song. Yeah. Why would I know that? I don't know, you look like you're 67. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm gonna check the time. You do not. not you, fool. It's nearly 11 o'clock. Seems about half an hour and a half. An hour and a half. Yeah, because we didn't get gone until 12.10. It's two hours. What are you doing? I don't know, but you can't look up when you do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you hear the light jazz? That's what I'm talking about. Hungry. Oh my god, Billy. I only had like two I'm not hungry and I haven't eaten anything in like eight hours. Eight hours. Eight hours. Like two hours, still. Steak and bacon. I had steak and bacon for breakfast. I had pancakes. Champion. I had like the whole of one. Hey, of there's the captain. That's not the captain. Oh, who is that? Just some lady. The lady that took our picture. There's some lady that took our picture. I'm going to take her picture now. <laughs> I don't think you realize, but. 
Slowly painting up your body. Hey. What's up? What's up? How you guys doing? Good. 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 <laughs> I'm gonna slowly paint up your body too. <laughs> I'm just filming people. <laughs> I'm just filming my own thing. I'll film who I want to. Take the bench with you. Everybody's taking seats. I hear you. Our parents are back. Good, 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 good. I'm just I'm just filming the same people over and over again. It's kind of creepy. And I'm testing the patience of sorry, testing the patience of people watching this. Alright. 